Hi, this is Jason from Horrific Nightmares. Welcome back to the Terror in the Isles Challenge. This is the segment I've been doing with my good buddy, Joe the Horror Man, where we're going to examine films from the movie Terror in the Isles. Not only the theatrical cut, but the television cut as well. Today we're going to be talking about The Fun House. The Fun House is a 1981 film which runs approximately 96 minutes and is directed by Toby Hooper. Now he passed away on August 26, 2017 at the age of 74. He was responsible for Eaten Alive, The Texas Chainsaw Massacre, and Poltergeist. Now this stars Elizabeth Barrage as Amy Harper. She was in Amadeus, Hidalgo, and Results. Sean Carson as Joey Harper. He was in Something Wicked, This Way Comes, and One TV Movie. And Jean Austin as Mrs. Harper. She passed away on February 1st, 2012 at the age of 76. She was in Stuckley's Last Stand. Now this had a worldwide gross of 7,886,857 dollars. And Toby Hooper was bitten by a brown recluse spider while filming. And they were also actually watching a, a movie in the film that we're watching as well, which is The Bride of Frankenstein, which I thought was pretty cool. Uh, the Fun House has a really cool story. A girl goes out with a group of people and they go to a carnival. Now, this carnival has, of course, a fun house where they have barkers. It's just a really pleasant carnival atmosphere that I love in film. And an interesting thing about the uh, barker is that he actually plays three different parts of the, in the film, three different barkers, and he said he wouldn't do the film unless he could play all three parts. So I thought that was pretty cool. So the kids take a ride in the fun house after looking at all the oddities, the two-headed cows, and stuff like that. And they decide, since they're pretty lit up, they're high and everything like that, that they are going to spend the night in the funhouse. Well, they just happen to witness a murder. And everything goes downhill from there. And I'm going to leave the plot there in case you haven't seen the funhouse. Is it my favorite Toby Hooper film? Ugh, that's a tough one. I love the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, but this movie has the ultimate carnival experience. It just, even down to the parking, parking in the field, it's just, it's a really cool film. Now, my relatable recommendation may come as a bit of a surprise, but I'm going to recommend a walleye movie called Scream Park. This has always been one of my favorites. This movie is, of course, low budget, but it's a lot of fun, and it does have Doug Bradley in it. He's not in it very much, but he is actually in the film, and this is a really fun slasher that takes place at a carnival. Don't forget to check out Joe's review and see what he picked as a relatable recommendation. And if you like what you see in here, hit that like button and subscribe. And until next time, peace.